Hi, Zach Gligar. We're here at the Dupnik Manor, one of the most haunted places in Northern California. Today we're going to investigate if this truly is one of the most haunted places on Earth. And I'm duct tape. I'm here to stick it to the ghosts. I've been chasing the ghosts of my past for as long as I've been alive. But in a much more real, honest sense, I've been hunting ghosts for about three and a half days. My work laid me off. It's chilling the air tonight, Zach. Yeah, Duck. It's gonna be one of those days, I feel like. Yeah. I feel the haunted air around this house. We're making contact with the uh, owner of the uh, location. Here it comes. Better play cool. Guys, I am so happy you could make it. <laughs> Please to be of assistance. Of course. Ever since all of those Civil War soldiers started decomposing and turning into oil, the ghosts in this place have been going wild. Yes, the Civil War happened here. Yeah. Tell us what's been going on around here. You put the spook in your ointment. Well... Ever since things started happening here, you know, I called up a guy before, some Bryson Jones, plucky chap, and uh, things were fine at first, he seemed to be getting around the house, and the next thing I knew, he was just gone. Next day, that thing appears. Huh? The glass of water? No. What? I'm talking about the statue. Oh! <laughs> Interesting. This... I don't think this is water. What is it? Can't tell for sure. It might be ectoplasm. But there's only one way to know for sure. Ghosts have a supernatural influence on decks of cards. If we draw the same... Okay. This is how we know. Ready? Yeah. Let's draw. Eight of clubs. We both have the six of spades. I'm sorry, but we're gonna need to bring in some extra equipment. Yeah. Whatever that takes. It's gonna. All right, Zach and Dexter. I've got some specialized equipment okay. in the trunk right for this here. Okay. First, what I got? I got a spectral anomaly salizer. This baby right here can sense out ghosts wherever which way you point it for the uninitiated ghost hunter. And this baby right here, this is some special equipment. Now, to the undrained eye, it may look like a DVD player, but I assure you, it is of the highest quality spectral scanner. You basically you, you use the Joy Cons, and it points you wherever you find a ghost because you just gotta scan. It's in the name. Now, what do you got? A Winco flashlight. Perfect. I'll be real with you. I'm a little worried these aren't the guys I hired. They seem a bit too competent. As it was just in this garage was the last time I saw Captain Sriracha. I'm getting But I have to tell you something very important if you're gonna find him and catch the ghost. <gasps> you know what this means? We, we need, need the big guns! Are you ready, Zach Breath? Yeah. Let's go. Ghost. Ghost. Let's just go. Let's just go. <laughs> Woo! We froze it. Excellent. Let's get this remarkably solid ghost inside. <laughs> Let's see who this ghost really is. <gasps> Thornton Dwap? Dwapnik? What? But well, why? You caught me. I was just trying to hunt the most dangerous game. Man. Man. <laughs> well, uh, we're not licensed to deal with that. Oh. Uh, I, 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 I think I, I think we should. Is, is that the end of the episode? Well, yeah, we should go. This is Zach Gligarian. Duct tape. And we just caught ourselves. A Whatever human this guy hunter. is. 